I S U P K. Hey, Salam, man. It's Priest Kevin in Don Hall with the I S U P K. And the commander Johnny Yahana in California, man. It's like all blacks, Hispanics, and any Indians. Subscribe to this channel, man. You want true salvation? You gotta learn from the priests and prophets of the I S U P K, man. Subscribe to that channel. Hit that button, man. And it's there with that. Salam. All I ever wanted was to be a gangster. Little did I know I wasn't danger. Decisions that I made provoked the Lord's anger Pray to him all the time, but I was just a stranger All I ever wanted was to be a gangster Little did I know I was in danger Decisions that I made provoked the Lord's anger Pray to him all the time, but I was just a stranger All I wanted was to be a gangster And shot call To be known with them niggas letting shots off Either that or the right hand to the top door Funny how we see vanity and not the lives lost Can't be focused on a life that's hopeless Out there pumping, not knowing the Lord will kill you for that hocus pocus Used to roll with niggas that cook dope with weaponry Same ones claim they love you, I had your life in jeopardy And I know my mother won't success for me But that G should take a girl straight to ecstasy you, you can't love the victim and the person who commit the crime, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. You can't love Amber Geiger and then love Bo Bolton John at the same time. You're going to have to serve one master. You're going you to have to serve one master. You understand? You love Amber Geiger, you love. You know who you love. You understand? That's what's going on, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. You can't serve two masters, man. You can't love the victim and at the same time love the oppressor. You can't do that, blacks, the Spanish and Native Indian. The church tried to teach you about doing that and it's getting us killed in America. You understand? Take for example what, what happened to that arm, to that church down there in South Carolina with Dylan Storm Roof. You understand? If the church taught us that we got enemies according to this Bible, you understand? Lives would be saved, man. Lives would be saved. You understand? That's why in the ICPK here, man, we teach a black brother the truth according to this Bible, man. Hispanic, the truth according to this Bible, man. And it's high time, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian, we got it together as the Bible say, man. Give me Zephaniah 2 and 1. Give me Zephaniah 2 and 1. You understand? You want to love, you want to love the oppressor. You want to love everything other than your own brother you're gonna get in trouble in this place man you understand we try loving we try loving the oppressor and look at what happened to us you understand look at what happened to us man innocent people losing their life and all black men losing their life a sister in the house a, a tatiana jefferson in the house children with her nephew and up comes a, a so-called oppressor and kills her. We can't hide nowhere. We can't see peace anywhere in this place. Why? Because I blame the churches, man. I blame the churches. You understand? For trying to show us to love the oppressor, man. You understand? Read where you at. Zephaniah chapter 2 verse 1. Gather yourselves together. What? Gather yourselves together. God is selling blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians to the what? Gather yourselves together. Yea, gather together, O nation not desire. He's saying gather together nation. And he's saying something very heavy. What? Read that last part. O nation not desire. He's saying, O nation not desire. Now I'm asking you a question, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. Who is not desired in America? Who's been killed? And I'm being killed. Cops going to court and getting off. Cops being suspended and paid suspension and getting off at the same time too. You understand? Like who is not desired in this place, man? The Hispanics, the Mexicans on the border. We don't even hear about them in the, in the news no more. They're on the border in concentration camp, in cages. We are a nation not desired. You understand? The so-called Native Indians have a high level of, of suicide. Why? Because they're depressed in America. 
They depress and oppress in America. You understand? But they don't give a damn about us because we are what? Old nation not desired. We are nation not desired. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian, man. We are a nation not desired by these other, by these other nations, man, by your oppressor. The same man that you go to church to learn to love, he's the same man killing you. He's the same man killing you in your own house while you're trying to chill. Both of John in his house, eating ice cream, watching a movie. And you tell me a, a cop came in and killed him? A Tatiana Jefferson in her house, chilling with her nephew, and up comes a white man, a oppressor, and kill him? Something, something is wrong in this place, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. You go to church, you learn to love the white man, but it's said, yep, and it's saying, the so-called oppressor, the so-called white man is the one killing you, killing us in this place. We love the wrong thing, man. Black people, as black people and Hispanic people and Native Indian people, we don't know what love is. We don't know what real love is. We don't know. Love is not loving the victim and the one that, that did the crime and the criminal. That's not love. You understand? That ain't love. We don't know what love is, man. We think love, love is flowers. We think love is hugs and kisses. That ain't love, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. That is not love. You understand? Love is an action. You understand? Martin Luther King said something, man. He said, don't judge the book by what? By the cover. Judge it by the what? By its action. You understand? We ain't judging our oppressor by the cover. We've been killed in the street by our so-called oppressor. That ain't no dream. That is reality for blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. That's reality for us. You understand? Read it again. You understand? Some people are just too dumb to realize that we love them. We're telling them you're the best on the face of the earth. You don't go tell, you don't go tell El Sharpton, shut the F up. You don't go tell Donald Trump, shut the F up. You understand? You don't go tell the radio station that shut the F up for playing all those disgusting, shaking behind music, strip club music. You don't tell them nothing. But you want to come and tell us, shut the F up. Because you are uneducated in this Bible. And I don't blame you. I blame our black leaders for the state of black people. Hispanics and Native Indian. I don't blame you. You don't understand the life you're living. You don't understand the enemy you got in front of you. But at ICPK, we do understand the enemy. And we're going to teach you in this Bible who the enemy is. We're going to teach you who to love and who not to give any love to blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. Your oppressor does not need your love. Abba Geiger does not need your love. Bolton John does. If Bolton John had our love, he would have been still alive today. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. You understand what I'm saying, man? If those nine people, if them, those nine innocent people in South Carolina know what real love is, if we have shown them what real love is, they'd have still been alive today. They'd have known that Dylan Storm Roof was supposed to be searched from head to toe. And I'm going one up on you. So I'll never let him in. Should have never let him in. That's because of Martin Luther King. Martin Luther King made it whereas we dropped our God. And now the churches took it up. Now black people, gods are totally dropped from the oppressor. Why the hell does America get FBI, the CIA, a military? Why? Because they got enemies. You understand? But they're going to tell us that we should all love. But where's all love for Saddam Hussein? Where's all love for, for, for um, um, Osama Bin Laden? Where's all love for that? You understand? You understand? 
their, the so-called oppressor, so-called America, their Christianity, Christianity is a good thing for the white man. The white man has shown that he is able to, stri to strive and survive under Christianity. His Christianity is totally different to the Christianity that are in the black churches. Totally different. You understand? His Christianity teaches him, if somebody hurts him, harm him, he got the right to go get justice. Our, our Christianity teaches us that we gotta be all about love. Hugs and kisses. You understand? Hugs and kisses. Uh, what, what was seen in that court about three weeks ago, that was Christianity at its finest. And it's killing black people. It's killing Hispanics and Native Indian people, man. Read it one more time. And then carry me to, Z to Lamentation 4. Gather yourselves together. Yea, gather together, O nation, not desire. Gather together, man. We gotta put down all that religion garbage, man. We gotta come out of the Christian church. We gotta come out of the mosque, man. We got a book right here that's our history, a black Bible, man. A black history book, Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. That's what we got right here, man. What we got right here is the most sought after book on the face of the earth. You know why? You know why? Because it got the solution. It got the solution for black people, Hispanics, and Native Indian, man. We in hell, but this Bible said that black man, you're going to be in the kingdom. You're going to be running the kingdom. You understand? We just got to change our ways. Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. Your oppressor and all these other heathens, they can do, they can jump low, jump high, get on a knee until it bleed. God is not going to hear their prayer. God hear your prayer, black people, Hispanics, and Native Indian people. God here heard your voice in Egypt and sent Moses for blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian. God heard your voice in Egypt. And America is the brand new Egypt according to this Bible, blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian. You understand what I'm saying? Thank you, brother. You understand? Tell them, tell them where you at. This is, this is the book of Lamentations, chapter four and 17. As for us, our eyes as yet fail for, for our vain help. Hold on, the Bible saying, as for us, blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian, our eyes have failed for what? For our vain help. For what? Vain help. Our vain help. You call the cops to do what? To help, yes, to protect. Yes, but when the cop comes, you get killed. Yes, you, get, you get killed. We have looked for what? Vain help. For vain help. You go inside the court in America to get justice. And what you get? You get the opposite of justice, man. 10 years I'm the guy to get for murdering a brother in cold blood. Our lives mean nothing in America, man. Our lives mean nothing in America. You understand? If if you can get an off a white officer on tape shooting an unarmed black man, and that officer gets off, we are what? As for us, our eyes as yet fail for our vain help. Our eyes have looked for that what vain help. That vain help mean what? Nothing. America is not here to help black people. It's not here to help black people. You know who is here to help? Your oppressor. You understand? Your oppressor. Who making all the money off of the prisons? Who making all the money off of prison? Who making all the money off of your school, your education system? Who making all the money off the banking system? Who making all the money on the stock markets? Get what I'm telling you, black man? You understand what I'm telling you, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian? Like we are the bottom of the pole. 
Why are we at the bottom of the pole? Because we haven't woken up to see what these other nations are doing. Your so-called oppressor, he sticks together. Look, look at Chinatown. Who's a, who owns Chinatown? The so-called Chinese are communists. But they got Chinatown. Where's nigga town? Where's Negro town? You understand? Well, well, where's our town, blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians? How come we are not copying what these other nations are doing? America built, was built on racism. You understand? Was built on racism. You understand? Read it again. For as us, our eyes as yet fail for our vain hope. In our watching, we have watched for a nation that could not save us. I mean, watch for what? A nation that could not save us. We have watched for a oppressor that what? Could not save us. But then still he does what? He kills us. He kills us. You understand what I'm saying? Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indians? That's right, that's right. When we're in trouble, who do we call? We pick the phone up and we call the so-called white man. Yes, sir. 911. <laughs> you go, you go in court, you gotta go get a white a white lawyer. You understand? Johnny Cochran died. So you know it ain't, ain't, ain't nothing left now. You understand? You gotta go and go get him. You understand? And you think you're going to go inside America court system to get justice, black man? We've been marching for over 100 years, black man. We've been marching for over 100 years, black man. You think we're going to get justice in America? You're going to have to pray for justice, man. God going to have to bring justice down in this place. God is going to have to make sure our oppressor pay for his crimes that he has committed against blacks, Hispanics, and native okay, Indian men. You understand? Read. He died for you, he died for they hurt our steps. They what? They hurt our steps. They what? Hurt our steps. Now, who many of you all saw the buddy cam video of, of that murder in Texas? How many of us saw the video of that murder that happened in Texas? Against that sister, a Tatiana man, Jefferson. They do what? They hunt our steps. You understand? How many of all heard about a court record about Amber Geiger killing Bolton John? They what? They hunt our steps. They hunt our steps, man. By the same man, you going forth for justice. The same man that you want to love, hug, and kiss, they do what? They hunt our steps. They hunt our steps, black man. We like animals to the, to the so-called oppressor. That's why when we get shoot down in the street, it's like it's just like a, you step on a cockroach. You understand? You step on a cockroach, do you go to jail for stepping on a cockroach? You don't go to jail for stepping in a cockroach, right? But black, unarmed, unarmed black man being killed, on HD, on body calm, ain't nobody going to jail. It's like stepping on a cockroach. You understand? Which well, so lets you know what? Read it again from the top. They hunt our steps that we cannot go in our streets. That we what? Cannot go in our streets. We scared. When that cop pull up behind us while we driving, that heart be beating. Our heart be beating. When them lights pull up behind us, we try to remember whether we got all the brakes working in the back. We try to remember if we, we, do we put the, the right turn signal on. We try to remember everything to make sure we are right with the law. Why? Where did they get? They hurt our steps that we cannot go in our streets. Our end is near. Our what? Our end is near. Our end is near, black man. Our end is near. If we keep on loving these people, man, if we keep on hating one another and try to love your oppressor, our what? Our end is near. Our end is near, man. 
our end is near. Time for black people not to let their guard down, man. And for you not to let your guard down, black man, the first step is to get out of the Christian church. Get out of the Christian church, get out of the mosque, get out of any religion that ain't got you loving your own people, man. You're in a religion that separates you from your people. You're in the wrong place. You're in the wrong place, black man. You're the religion that separates you from another black man, from a Hispanic man, or a native Indian man. You're in the wrong place, man. You're in the wrong place. Read it out. Understand what I'm telling you, black man? This book that we're reading out of, it got nothing to do with religion. It got to do with laws. You understand? That's why we constantly ask black people this. What religion was Moses? Anybody can tell me? What religion was Moses? What religion was Abraham? Isaac? Ezekiel? What religion was Jacob? King Solomon? What religion was he in? What religion? I'm going to go one up on you. What religion was so called Jesus Christ in? You understand? Je Je Jesus Christ never sell no drugs. He was no Muslim. Muslim sell drugs. You understand? Christ was was no Muslim, and he was no Christian. Cause he don't sell drugs too. You understand? You understand? I know that. You understand? Jesus Christ didn't got no religion. I'm gonna help you out, blacks. This man is a native Indian. Jesus Christ was a black, poor brother from the ghetto who loved black people, Hispanic people, so much that he gave his life for them. That who was that that who Jesus Christ was. You understand? Read it. Our end is near. Our days are fulfilled. For our end is come. Our end is come. The white man has to pay, man. Our oppressor has to pay for the crimes he has committed against blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian, man. That's right. God is not going to sleep until our oppressor is in chain. That's right. God ain't going to sleep, blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian. It may look like God is sleeping, but God ain't sleeping. God is waiting for us to wake up. We're the ones that sleep in America. We're the ones that sleep in all type of religion, all type of philosophy. We're the ones that sleep. God waiting for us to wake up. He ain't sleeping. Read. Our, our, persecu our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. Our what? Our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. Our persecutors. The, the oppressor that comes to kill us are swifter than a what? Than the eagles of the, of the heaven. I, I'm the guide. Of the eagles of the heaven. Um, um what, 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 what's those cup, cup's name in um, who killed Eric Gardner? Pantaleo. You understand? Of you the eagles of the heaven. The, our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven, right? And what about that killing of Tatiana? The body cam shows the cop coming up to the window and say, never identify himself, and in a split second, shooting that sister. The what? Our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. Persecutors are swifter than it. They don't mean what? Our oppressor does not hesitate to kill us. Ain't no, well, hold up, that might be such and such son. Let me not kill him. It ain't nothing like that when it comes to us. But when you turn on, when you go on YouTube, and you turn on YouTube, you see cops. I saw a cop on YouTube. I forgot what, 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 what it was. I saw a cop on YouTube being ran down with an AK. The cop had an AK around, um, uh, M16 around him, and a handgun on him. And he was running from an unarmed, naked white man. 
How many of y'all remember seeing that video on YouTube? You understand? When it comes to his people, he hesitates. He tanks before he pulls the trigger. He ain't swift like an eagle when it comes to his people. But when it comes to blacks, Hispanics, and native Indian, guess what? Our persecutors are swifter than the eagles of the heaven. He is swift. He don't hesitate. He don't hesitate to pull the trigger. You understand? Prefer to be judged by what what he says? I prefer to be judged by 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 by, by twelve that that carry by six. He he holds that motor when it comes to us. And when you check it, the brother is totally unarmed. The sister is totally unarmed. He killing kids and all too. Tamir Rice was totally unarmed. But let's you know what? That our oppressor, we shouldn't be going to help to our for help to our oppressor blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. The Bible is telling us to gather together, man. Finish reading that. They pursued us upon the mountains. They laid wait for us in the wilderness. Meaning, meaning what? Blacks, Hispanics, and Native Indian. Meaning our oppressor will go to every extent to try to have us kill black man, Hispanic man. Your music too loud, he, he too loud is bothering him. He gonna wanna shoot. He gonna wanna kill you. You understand? Trying to find something to follow Hand loyalty, every man tried to borrow Felt pain and a lot of sorrow Got betrayed so packed I didn't even have my heart broke Living confused, about to lose hope Cops got me on the side of the road Like a sideshow, need an antidote before I croak Now I'm setting fire to rhythm man blues Call this guitar smoke Rebel with no cause, trying to find direction The world got me vexed Picked up a bad lick of habit that's already turned from oppression Felt like my life was on fire trying to find an exit Now look, 10 G's plus a good wreck Sometimes a follower is a soldier Trying to find a good shepherd Plus when you in hell, how do you excel? Wisdom the breath of life, I don't believe in fairy tale Listen well to what I tell No call it can cause pain Something that a rebel knows very well can't you tell I was sent from the Lord? Got a tongue like a two-edged sword.